Hello viewers, welcome to the channel Amazing Civil Engineering Studies. In today's video we are going to discuss about what is super elevation in road. The highway plays a vital role in the country's economic growth by connecting people and transporting goods. We may unaware of many implementations that the experts used for our safety while we are on the road. Point one of them is super elevation. The term super elevation denoted in both road and railway transport, especially in curved pathways. What is super elevation? To counteract the centrifugal force and to reduce the skid force on the turning curve, a slope provided on the outer edge of the road is called super elevation. There are practical upper limits to the rate of super elevation on a horizontal curve. These limits relate to considerations of climate, constructability, adjacent land use, and the frequency of slow-moving vehicles. The maximum value of super elevation providence as per the Indian Road Congress is 1 IN 15. The necessity of super elevation, advantages. Have you driven a bike or car faster on a curved road? While turning a curve, the vehicle loses its control and slightly moves outward from the center of the road due to the centrifugal force. It pushes the vehicle to the other end which might overturn the vehicle. So to control the oscillation, and to avoid any accidents, the outer edge of the road will be constructed in such a way that it slightly sloped high to the inner side. It is called super elevation or banking of the road. Objects of providing super elevation to counteract the effect of centrifugal force acting on the moving vehicle to pull out the same outward on a horizontal curve. To help a fast moving vehicle to negotiate a curved path without overturning and skidding. To ensure safety to the fast moving traffic. To prevent damaging effect on the road surface due to improper distribution of load. Super Elevation Formula The formula for finding the super elevation is E equals H equals BV2 slash GR where E equals super elevation of the road. B equals breadth of the road. G equals acceleration due to gravity, 9.81 ms. R equals radius of the curvature. V equals velocity slash speed of the vehicle. Let us discuss how the super elevation formula has arrived. Design Analysis When a vehicle is moving, the following forces will act on it, forces acting on the vehicle. Every structure has its types of loads. W Weight of the Vehicle F1, F2 Frictional Forces P centrifugal force where 1 equals 2 10 equals perpendicular base equals rise run 10 
1 equals 10, 2 e slash b equals p slash w, here w is width of the road. P centrifugal force equals mv2 slash r and w equals mge slash b equals mv2 slash rmg. E slash B equals V2 slash GR E equals BV2 slash GR. Minimum and Maximum Limits The minimum and maximum limits are based on the terrain conditions and class of road. The elevation should not provide too high because it pushes down the vehicle movement. The maximum elevation for snowfall areas is 7% and 10% for others. The recommended minimum super elevation provision for the road as per IRC is given in table below. Recommended minimum super elevation Advantages of super elevation it allows running a vehicle at high speed on a curved path as on a straight path without any danger of overturning and thus results into increased volume of traffic. It provides more or less even distribution of load on wheels and hence uniform stress is offered on the foundation which results into less wear on wheel tires and springs as well as economy in maintenance cost of the road. It also helps to keep the vehicles to their proper side on the pavement and thus prevents collision of vehicles moving in opposite directions on a curved portion of the road. It provides drainage of the whole width of road towards the inner side. Thus, there is no necessity of providing side drain on the outer side of the road. How to calculate super elevation? Example calculation. Let's see an example. How to calculate the super elevation for 9m wide road, radius 300m, the speed of a vehicle is 60 kmph and centrifugal ratio 1 tenth. Allowable limit E equals BV2 slash GR Super elevation formula B equals 9M V equals 60 kmph equals 16.66 ms G equals 9.81 ms R equals 250 M E equals 9 X 16.66 2 slash 9.81 X 300 equals 2498 slash 2943 e equals 0.85 m the super elevation of the road is 0.85 m dot check whether it is in the allowable limit allowable limit equals 1 tenth xb equals 0.1 x9 equals 0.9 m thanks for watching for now please subscribe like share and do not forget to press bell icon